For centuries, humanity has grappled with one of the most profound questions. What separates the mind from the body? At first glance, the division seems obvious. Your thoughts feel intangible while your body is undeniably physical. This age-old perspective, known as mind-body dualism, has been a cornerstone of Western philosophy and science for generations. But what if the separation is little more than an illusion, a deeply ingrained narrative that's kept us from understanding the true nature of existence? The origins of this concept trace back to ancient thinkers like René Descartes, whose famous declaration, I think, therefore I am, sought to distinguish the immaterial mind from the mechanical body. In his view, the mind operated on a spiritual plane, while the body functioned like a machine, a mere vessel. This framework shaped not only philosophy but also medicine, psychology, and science for centuries, placing an artificial boundary between thoughts and physical processes. Yet, as our understanding of the universe has evolved, cracks in this traditional view have begun to appear. Modern neuroscience has revealed the intricate interplay between thoughts, emotions, and physical states, suggesting that the mind and body might not be as separate as we once believed. Think of the gut-brain connection. Your emotions influence digestion, and your gut health impacts your mood. This isn't just coincidence. It's evidence of a deeper unity that challenges dualistic thinking. And here's where the limitations of the old perspective become evident. If we cling to the notion of a rigid divide, we fail to explain phenomena like the placebo effect, where mere belief triggers tangible physical changes. How can the immaterial power of thought alter the biological machinery of the body? Traditional science struggles to answer this, leaving a void that demands a fresh perspective. This brings us to the idea of a unified mind-body experience. Far from existing as two separate entities, the mind and body may operate as a single, interconnected system, an elegant dance of energy, information, and consciousness. What if your thoughts aren't just fleeting whispers in the ether but active participants in shaping your physical reality? As we explore this idea further, ancient philosophies might offer surprising insights. Eastern traditions like Ayurveda and Taoism have long embraced the interconnectedness of mind, body, and spirit. For them, this isn't a revolutionary concept. It's a truth they've lived by for millennia. And now, quantum physics, with its groundbreaking revelations, could finally provide the scientific language to describe what these traditions have intuited all along. Prepare to challenge everything you thought you knew about yourself and the world. The answers may not lie in separating the mind and body, but in decoding the intricate connections that bind them. Reality as we know it is far stranger and far more interconnected than we've been led to believe. For centuries, Classical physics gave us a comforting sense of order, with its clear rules and predictable patterns. But then came quantum physics, shattering our old paradigms and revealing a universe that operates on a far deeper, more mysterious level. At the heart of this new understanding lies the concept of wave-particle duality, a phenomenon that challenges everything we thought we knew about existence. Imagine a single particle of light, a photon. Depending on how you observe it, this photon can behave like a particle existing in one specific location or like a wave spreading out across space in multiple possibilities at once. The mere act of observation determines its state. Think about that. Reality itself seems to shift based on awareness. But it gets even stranger. Enter the phenomenon of quantum entanglement, often referred to as spooky action at a distance. When two particles become entangled, their states become linked, no matter how far apart they are. Change one particle and the other responds instantly, even if they're on opposite sides of the universe. This isn't just theoretical. It's been demonstrated in countless experiments. Entanglement defies our understanding of time and space, hinting at a hidden layer of reality where everything is connected. What does this mean for us? It means that the universe isn't as rigid or isolated as we once thought. Instead, it's a fluid, dynamic web of relationships where everything influences everything else. The implications are profound. 
If particles can exist in multiple states simultaneously and communicate instantaneously across vast distances, what does that say about our understanding of reality? And then, there's the question of consciousness. Could it be that our awareness plays a role in shaping the universe at its most fundamental level? Some scientists suggest that consciousness might not just be an observer of the quantum world. It might be a participant, collapsing probabilities into tangible outcomes. In other words, what you focus on could directly influence what becomes real. This challenges the classical view of the universe as a machine operating independently of human experience. Instead, quantum physics invites us to see reality as deeply interconnected and influenced by the very act of observation. It's a perspective that aligns remarkably well with ancient wisdom traditions, which have long spoken of the unity between the observer and the observed. The implications don't stop at the theoretical level. They stretch into fields like medicine, technology, and even our understanding of free will. If the quantum world is so deeply interconnected, could it explain phenomena like intuition, synchronicity, or even the way our emotions seem to ripple outward, affecting not just ourselves but those around us? Quantum physics doesn't just rewrite the rules of the game, it redefines the playing field itself. And as we move forward, we'll explore how these revelations bridge the gap between consciousness and reality, pushing us closer to uncovering the ultimate truth about the nature of existence. What if the essence of who you are, your awareness, your thoughts, your very sense of self, is not confined to your brain but woven into the fabric of the universe itself? This is the bold idea that's emerging at the crossroads of science and philosophy. Consciousness, long dismissed by material science as a mere byproduct of brain activity, is now being reconsidered as something far more fundamental, perhaps even the foundation upon which reality is built. Quantum physics has opened doors to understanding consciousness in ways we never thought possible. One of the most tantalizing theories suggests that consciousness could play a direct role in shaping the physical world. Recall the famous double-slit experiment. The act of observing particles as they pass through two slits changes their behavior. Without observation, particles behave like waves, existing in a state of probability. But when observed, they collapse into a definite state. This raises an extraordinary possibility. Your awareness might be an active participant in determining what becomes real. And this isn't just abstract theory. Scientists are uncovering mounting evidence of connections between quantum processes and the brain. Some researchers propose that microtubules, tiny structures within neurons, might operate at the quantum level, allowing consciousness to influence physical processes. If true, this would mean that the very thoughts you think could resonate on a quantum scale, connecting you to the greater field of existence. But here's where things get truly mind-expanding. Several cutting-edge theories argue that consciousness isn't confined to individual beings but is instead a universal force. Think of it like a vast ocean, with individual minds acting as waves that rise and fall. From this perspective, your personal awareness is a localized expression of something infinite, something cosmic. Could it be that your mind isn't merely perceiving reality but actively co-creating it? This idea aligns with spiritual philosophies that have existed for thousands of years. Many traditions speak of consciousness as the ultimate reality, a force that transcends time and space. Quantum physics is now providing a scientific framework to revisit these ancient ideas, offering potential explanations for experiences that defy conventional understanding, such as intuition, synchronicity, or even near-death experiences. Consider this. If consciousness is fundamental to the universe, it means that your awareness has the power to shape not just your personal experience but the very nature of reality itself. This perspective turns the traditional materialist worldview on its head. Instead of seeing yourself as a passive observer in a mechanistic universe, you become an active participant in a cosmic dance of energy and possibility. The implications are profound. Could this explain why deeply held beliefs or emotional states seem to influence outcomes in our lives? Why moments of clarity or heightened awareness often coincide with profound external changes? Science is only beginning to scratch the surface, 
but the answers being uncovered suggest that the boundary between the subjective and the objective might be far thinner than we ever imagined. As we explore further, one question looms larger than ever. What if consciousness isn't just part of the universe but its very foundation? If so, the way we view reality, ourselves, and our potential must evolve. This isn't just a theoretical shift, it's a personal one, inviting you to rethink your role in the grand tapestry of existence. What if the secret to health, well-being, and personal growth lies in understanding the delicate interplay between your mind and body, a connection that operates not just biologically but at the quantum level? This isn't just a theoretical concept. It's an emerging frontier that redefines how we view healing, growth, and the very nature of human potential. For centuries, the connection between the mind and body was acknowledged primarily through anecdotal evidence or ancient traditions. Practices like meditation, yoga, and acupuncture have long emphasized this unity. But now, quantum physics is offering a scientific lens to explore what these practices have intuitively understood. The mind and body are not separate. They are deeply intertwined in ways that defy conventional explanation. Consider this. Every thought, every emotion you experience triggers a cascade of biological responses. When you're stressed, your body releases cortisol, a hormone that prepares you for survival but, when sustained, can weaken your immune system. On the other hand, feelings of love, gratitude, and joy can promote healing and even lower inflammation. These aren't abstract ideas, they are measurable effects. But how does this happen? From a quantum perspective, the answer lies in the energy and information that flow between your mind and body. In quantum systems, particles exist not as isolated entities but as interconnected waves of potential. Similarly, your mind and body seem to share an energetic relationship, with thoughts acting as signals that influence physical processes. Imagine your body as a finely tuned instrument and your thoughts as the vibrations that determine its harmony or discord. One of the most intriguing applications of this understanding is in the realm of healing. Studies have shown that the placebo effect, a phenomenon where belief alone can lead to real physical changes, may be evidence of the mind's ability to influence matter. But what if the placebo effect is more than just a quirk of the human brain? What if it's a glimpse into the quantum interplay between consciousness and the body? Quantum principles like non-locality suggest that changes in one part of a system can instantaneously affect another, even at great distances. Could this explain why practices like visualization, affirmations, or even prayer seem to yield tangible results in physical health? By focusing your awareness on a desired outcome, you may be influencing the underlying quantum field that connects mind and body. This perspective has profound implications for how we approach not only healing but also personal growth. If the mind-body connection is truly quantum in nature, it means that your thoughts, emotions, and intentions are far more powerful than you've been led to believe. They don't just reflect your reality, they shape it. For instance, consider the potential of mindfulness practices. By bringing conscious awareness to your thoughts and feelings, you're not just calming your mind, you're actively influencing your body at the quantum level. This isn't just a tool for stress relief, it's a pathway to transformation, but the implications go beyond the individual. If mind-body harmony operates on quantum principles, it raises questions about the collective impact of human consciousness. Could our shared thoughts and intentions shape not just personal outcomes but societal and even global realities? Quantum physics shows us that we're all connected, and this interconnectedness may extend to our collective well-being. The power to heal, grow, and transform might not lie in external solutions but within the intricate quantum dance of your own mind and body. This isn't just about treating symptoms. It's about understanding the root of health and harmony at the deepest level. And as we embrace this perspective, we begin to see that the mind and body are not just linked. They are one. We are standing at the threshold of a revolution in how we understand ourselves and the universe. The idea that the mind and body are separate has shaped human thought for centuries. But today, science and philosophy are revealing a much more profound truth. 
The mind and body are part of an inseparable, unified whole, intricately connected at the deepest levels of reality. The implications of this shift are staggering. It invites us to rethink what it means to heal, grow, and even exist. When you consider the quantum principles at play, the interconnectedness, the role of observation, and the potential influence of consciousness, you begin to see that human potential is not limited by the physical or the material. Instead, it is boundless, shaped by the dynamic interplay of awareness, intention, and the quantum field of possibilities. What does this mean for your everyday life? First, it challenges you to step out of old paradigms and into a more integrated, holistic view of yourself and the world. It means recognizing that your thoughts, emotions, and awareness aren't just passive experiences. They are active forces, capable of influencing your health, your relationships, and even the reality you experience. This perspective also invites a sense of personal responsibility. If consciousness truly plays a role in shaping reality, then the power to transform your life lies within you. The choices you make, the thoughts you nurture, and the awareness you cultivate all ripple outward, shaping not only your personal journey but the world around you. But beyond the individual, this shift in understanding calls for a collective awakening. Imagine a society that embraces the interconnectedness of mind and body, of individuals and the universe. A world where healing is not about fixing isolated problems, but about fostering harmony within and without. A world where consciousness is celebrated as a fundamental force, guiding us toward greater understanding, empathy, and unity. As we move forward, the importance of open-minded exploration cannot be overstated. This journey into the quantum mind-body connection is still unfolding, with new discoveries waiting on the horizon. But what's clear is that we are only beginning to scratch the surface of what's possible when we expand our understanding of consciousness and reality. This is not just a scientific or philosophical exploration. It's an invitation. An invitation to reimagine your existence, to embrace your potential, and to see yourself not as a separate observer in a detached universe, but as an integral part of a vast, interconnected whole. So, as you reflect on everything we've explored, ask yourself, what would your life look like if you fully embraced this paradigm? How would your choices, your beliefs, and your understanding of reality evolve? The answers to these questions might just redefine everything you thought you knew about yourself and about the universe. This is more than a new way of thinking. It's a new way of being. And as you step into this expanded awareness, remember, the potential within you is as limitless as the quantum realm itself.